guys, and it's Jay here, and I, this is my first video for my channel, and the description that I'm, that I'm doing, I'm gonna unbox Funko Pops, talk about collectibles, and maybe do some random stuff, so, um, so let's get started with the video, and if you don't know what a Funko Pop is, this is pretty much what it is. It's like a smaller version vinyl figure of movies, video games, TV shows, you name it. And I actually have John Cena here. He was actually my first Funko Pop. And yeah, he has the You Can't See Me little necklace, the bicep six pack. And yeah, let, so let's move on. Uh, my second one, I have the Vulture, the Spider-Man Homecoming Vulture vinyl figure. And I bet you're wondering, why do I keep this in a box? Well, I went to my friend's house one day, and he had the same exact vinyl figure. And it was all broken and busted, and I didn't want that to happen. So, yeah, I kept it in the box. Let's get a close-up for you. Let's see. And on the back, it actually has more you can collect. It has Spider-Man, and then Spider-Man in a homemade suit. You got Peter... Peter Parker, sorry. Peter Parker, yeah, Tony Stark, and yeah, Butcher, just like the one I have on the box. So, moving that along. Uh, I haven't really played this game before. I've watched people play it, and it's it looks really fun. And I know most of the characters, and it's actually Junkrat. He's from Overwatch, if you don't know. And I was at, um, com... All Star Comics, and which is a good comic store, is where you can find good pop figures like this one. And he, yeah, his detail is really nice. He got the little arm and, and this little backpack. And yeah, and I take them out of the box because they come with the stand, and you know I don't want it to go to waste. So anytime a pop figure doesn't have a stand, then I might keep it in the box, or if it's really nice, then I'll take it out. But yeah, get me with the stand. So, I'll um, move that. So, coming along. Okay. So, it, this is an Xbox game. So, and I've played it before. And it, it's, it's really fun. And, yeah. So, it's the Cuphead Vinyl Figure. The Cuphead, the Cuphead Funko Pop. And I found this one at a library, at a bookstore, and my sister got it for me. So the thing I like is like the detail. He has little milk ripples and a straw. So the inspiration who made, who, who I got inspired from for collecting vinyl figures and stuff is Lamar Wilson. Yeah, go check him out. He said he didn't really like the little Pac-Man eyes, but I, I like it. It has that old theme, and it just looks real cool. It's like the old theme, because, you know, Cuphead's little old theme. Uh, yeah, any of y'all watch Betty Boop? I grew up around Betty Boop, Woodpecker, Looney Tunes. Okay, so our final pop figure that I have in my collection is the King Dice Funko Pop. And the thing that I like, well, the detail is just, see, you got the number five, the number three, the number six, and the number two. And I just figured out today, and I was, like, looking at him, and his nose is actually the number one dot. And, yeah, I got this, and my family said it was creepy, but I, I, I like it. He has a little devilish smile, the Pac-Man eyes, beady the little eyebrows, his rosy cheeks, so a close up. Let's see, look at the back of him. That's his little... He's actually one of my favorite villains. So yeah, that concludes my collection. So let me let me get them all out here. So you, so you can all see them all together. So, yeah, let me put that over there. Sorry. Um, As you can see, this is my collection so far. If you guys like this, make sure you like and subscribe to my videos. And, 
yeah and if you want me to unbox some stuff then yeah so hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video bye